A day in the life of a Texas high school football coach, night practice. We're holding today's spring practice at night to give college coaches in the area a chance to watch your guys. It's going to be a longer day, so I sleep in until about 6 and arrive at work at 6.15 or so. Our head coach sets aside one night of spring ball for night practice. That way more of the college guys can make it work with their schedules. I got to the building and nobody else was here. I took a scoop of lime pre-workout from Bucked Up. Don't forget the link in my bio where you can get free samples and discounts on your supplements. I got down to the weight room and got a good lift in. Being first means I also get to control the music this morning. Jammed out with some 3-6 Mafia while I lifted. I grabbed my keys to take my daughter to school and when I got back I put my lunch in the fridge. After that I went and got cleaned up and changed into my teaching sweatpants. I watched some film from yesterday's practice and then we had a meeting in the team room to talk about how this afternoon will work. Me and Coach Hines ran out to the store. When we got back, we headed up for class. I got everything set up in my classroom, and then I looked over the practice schedules for this afternoon. We'll scrimmage the JV guys from 4 o'clock to 5 o'clock, and then the varsity practice will start about 6.45. I get a filmer schedule made so we can get the JV scrimmage on film, and then make sure we get our night practice recorded as well. We have some very dedicated student filmers that do a ton for us. At lunch, I head down and drink a protein shake and eat my leftovers. I have two more class periods before my athletics period. During my afternoon classes, I went ahead and cracked open a buckshot. I was ready to go when the bell rang and I headed down to change for the JV practice. Our coordinator stayed in and lifted the varsity guys while the rest of us coached the JV guys. In between the JV scrimmage and the varsity practice, we fed the varsity guys Chick-fil-A so they didn't have to practice on an empty stomach. We brought the defensive backs in for film about 5.45. That way we can cover any mistakes that need to be fixed before practice begins. On our way out, we grab some of the equipment from the equipment room that we'll need for today. We get everything set up for practice and period one starts at about 6.50. We had several college coaches in attendance to watch our guys. Hopefully it'll lead to some scholarship opportunities for them. We get everybody inside and then we upload the film to huddle. I shower up and grab my keys before heading out. And I finally end up getting home about 9 o'clock or so.